Hello everybody and welcome back to another episode of Building with a Sausage. This is Mythical Sausage here. Hello, what is up everybody? Man, we are back again here in our tutorial world. We're going to continue with this village upgrade. And man, we've been doing some cool stuff. We got this little tiny little starter house over here. We went over here to the next level, did a medium sized starter house. And then we jumped over here and did this farm. Oh, I love this village upgrade. It's, it's gonna, I think, I don't know. I have a feeling it's gonna turn out to be one of my favorites of all times. So we're going with a medieval style, super cool. But if you guys wanna check out any of these builds, we got a link in the description with the playlist. Go check them out if you haven't seen them. We got three cool ones, and today is gonna be a fun one. It's a, it's a, it's a requested one. It's one that's been requested for a very long time, so upgrade a church. We're not gonna upgrade this one over here. We're gonna save that for something else. I'm gonna upgrade this one and I separated us a little bit I gave it a little bit of room because over here we had a build and uh, we had a build I think right here So I got rid of those we have more space to work with the church But we're gonna do the church right now But if you guys also want to check out this texture pack look how beautiful this pack is so nice Best vanilla pack in the game germs a boy. You are the best boy. You're the best. You're the best and I, I'm not gonna even I'm not I'm gonna I'm gonna start singing it in five minutes if you guys want to check out Jerry's pack I also have it in the description go download it. It's amazing. There's versions of this for Java for bedrock edition It's, it's, it's it, German's doing some work. Uh, so go check that out But let's start right now and upgrading this ugly old village this ugly old default village We're gonna make it very nice very cool and this church needs a lot of work. So um yeah, let's start. <laughs> I'm gonna leave the dimensions. I, a lot of the times when I upgrade these churches, I go really crazy with it, and I just make it uh, 10 times bigger than it's supposed to be. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna make it a little bigger though, because it's kind of small, but we are gonna use the um, the primary dimensions that's here. So let's just play with it. So I'm gonna be using a lot of the stones. So we got regular stone, stone brick, stone brick stairs, cobblestone stairs, uh, and I'm bringing spruce, just a spruce family along the way to work on a little roof pattern and stuff like that. So first off, let's start it up. What I wanna do first, okay, Okay, we can keep this cobble for now, but I will texture it. Let's move this here. You see this little thing right here? Let's move this. Cause I don't know why they did this. I don't know what this is. Let's move this down to there. And let's also move this down to here. That looks very, <laughs> very bad, but we're gonna keep upgrading it. Okay, so first step, what I wanna do, I wanna increase this entryway right here. Uh, so I wanna go ahead. Let's bring stone brick. Hello, villager. Hello to you too. You know what? Get this door out of here. You stop it. Get out of here. Okay, so we're gonna put a stone brick here, stone brick here, one here, and one there. Okay, let's do that. You guys are so loud. Hold on, let me t turn down this. Uh, oh my god. Okay, I think that worked. Let's see. Okay, so let's keep going. So we got this go right here. Okay, now next up, what I want to do is, uh, I'm gonna get rid of this roof piece right here. Let's get rid of that. Leave that there. Look at all these to torches. Get out. Uh, get out of here, torches. Okay, so <laughs> let's leave it just like this. So if we're counting from this end right here, this is a one, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight, and a nine. Okay, you know what? Let's lift this also up. I'm gonna lift it up with the stone right there. I'm gonna lift this one up with the stone right here. So this is a nine right here. Now, you know what? Let's take this out. Let's take this out. And you know what? I'm going to also do, let's leave this up here for now. Okay, so let's do this. Now, next up, what I wanna do is right here on this line, I'm gonna go down. So from this corner, let's go one, two, three, four, five. This corner, one, two, three, four, five. And you know what? Let's take this window out. I don't want you there. Bye bye, window. And let's cross right here. Okay? Right there. Perfect. So we got this little box going. You know what I want to do? Let's go down from right here as well. Let's go down all the way down. And then we're going to go up all the way, meeting up to that point. Let's go back on this side. Take this down right here. So we're going to go one, two, three, four, five. And that's a six. Okay. So we have that box going right now. So this is what I want to start doing. I want to, I want to pop this out. I'm gonna pop this out. We're gonna pop it out right here, okay? Right here. So go one, two, three, four, and a five. And then we're gonna cross one. This is one, two, three, four, five. And seal this box up. Seal that box up. So that's a five. So let's do the same thing on this side. So from right here, one, two, three, four, five, cross, one, two, three, four, five. And then we're gonna cross right there. So we have this two pop outs right there. Perfect. You know what? I want to extend this now backwards one time. And we're going to do the same exact thing. So right here, one, two, three, four, five. And right here, one, two, three, four, and one, two, three, four, five. So that, okay, so we got this box. So let's go up. So we got this dimension right there. Simple, easy, lovely. Let's go. <laughs> so now, this is what I want to do. Knock this wall out. Knock this wall out right here. Right there. Knock out everything you see on the inside. Everything. Right there. Okay. 
Now, knock this wall out too. We're gonna knock this wall out. So just a little bit of an extension just to get more room. And then we're gonna knock this little piece out right here as well, right there. Now, let's just fill it all in with cobble for now. Fill it all in with cobble right here. Fill this in with cobble as well. And fill this in with cobble. Get, get out. Get out of here, you're, you're in the way. Blacksmith, thank you. What are you trading? I, I'll find out later. Okay, <laughs> so we have this for now. Now, do this. Let's go right here on this side and go up. One, two, three, four, and five, and cross beam this as well, okay? This way we're gonna go again. One, two, three, four, and five, and cross this up as well. Cross that up right there, and then we're gonna do the same thing on this corner. So go all the way up by five, cross this as well. Over here, cross this as well. And then, uh, yeah, you guessed it. We're gonna cross this one as well, going all the way up like that. And then we're gonna go all the way up like this. So bum, 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 bum. So we're gonna be using a lot of stone at the beginning, at the bottom. And then we're gonna be using our spruce wood for the tippy top. So let's do it like that. Now, let's go over here. I'm gonna raise from this one. So this is technically one, two, three, four, five, and six. So we're gonna match that. So right here again, so this is one, two, three, four, five, six. We're gonna match that. And then what I wanna do is just leave that there for now. Okay, leave that there for now. Let's do this. Let's grab our cobble and we're gonna just raise it up on all of these sides right here. All of this side right here, we're gonna raise this up all over here as well. We're gonna raise everything. So let's go really fast and let's raise all of these up and meet up in the top. And then we'll do a little bit of a texture job and I'll show you how we're doing that at the end. But first off, let me just cover all these in cobblestone. Hold on a minute. All right, so everything's covered in cobblestone. Everything's looking lovely. So I wanna do a little bit of a texture job, not too much, but I wanna bring stone in here and just randomly pepper in some stone on the cobble only. We're not gonna to touch the outer border of the stone. So we're just gonna put uh, a little bit of texturing here with just a smooth stone on certain spots. You don't have to put it exactly where I'm doing it. It's just to give it a little bit of variation. Uh, we might come in and put some windows, but I want to do the texture job first. So it looks a little cooler. So let's do this real fast. It's random. So something like this. So far, so good. Yes, it is. Okay, now let's do another bit of a texture job here or a, a little bit of a outline. So we have this outline here in the corner right here on this side as well. I'm going to knock these out and continue that outline right here as well. Continue that little outline that's going throughout the whole build right here. It's all in the same line right there. Bye-bye, whatever that uh, letter. Okay, so we have this all the way around. See this line that goes all the way around here? Okay, perfect. Now, this is what I wanna start doing, okay? Uh, before we get into the details of this thing, let's st lay down a little bit of a roof. Is I wanna do a little roof on this outside border here really fast. This is how I'm doing it. So let's grab this uh, spruce, and we're gonna go all the way down like that, right here on this corner. Do a little upside down stair, and we're gonna go up gradually, very simple, just like this. Meeting up in the middle with an upside down stair and a stair this way. And then we're going to go back down this direction. So let's go all the way down like this and then take it all the way down. We're going to take it all the way down. And we're going to wrap it around like this and then pop this one out. Okay, so let's do this one now too. So going like this, going all the way around. We're going to match it doing the same pattern, same simple stair design going up and down like so. And then uh, you guessed it, we're going to twist it and we're going to do it on the other side as well. And it's going to be looking very, very cool. Let's go all the way down, bam, right there. And then we're going to do it again, the same stair pattern all the way around till we get to the middle. And again, upside down stair, stair this way. And we're going to bring it all the way down like so right there. And then bring it all the way down like that. Now, guess what? I'm also going to bring it down this way. Look at this. Take it down to that side on this one. Same thing, we're gonna twist this there and we're gonna go all the way right to there and then let's do that pattern one more time. And look, it's gonna to connect to that little piece that we left from last time, isn't that cool? And then get rid of this window. We're not gonna need your window. Get out of here. And then let's do that, 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 there and there. We have it right here on this side as well. And now as you're gonna see, we're gonna do some stuff with this thing. So keep that in mind. We're gonna do some things. So now let's do this part two. I'm gonna bring this all the way down and it's gonna connect to, you know what? Let's gonna connect in here too. Let's just do boop right there. And we're gonna keep this going all the way down. Let's connect all these stairs together. It's gonna be a little hard to do this one. This one's gonna be complicated. Let's see if we can do it without messing up. Oh, I messed it up already. You know what, what if I do that? That's fine. <laughs> let's see if we can do it. Come on, I believe. There it goes, all the way down. Oh, we're doing it good now, look at this. Look at this, hold on. Oh, wow, okay, we're doing it. Now let's continue that, going all the way down like this. And this is gonna connect to that guy. Now let's do it right here. We're gonna go this way, twist it. It's gonna connect to here. And then this one's gonna do the same thing. We're gonna go all the way around like so. And then this one's gonna connect to this one right here. Watch, bam, 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 perfect. Let's do this one, we're almost done. 
So let's twist it all the way down. And then this one again, going all the way around. I misclicked so many times. So this is gonna keep going and then we're gonna connect and done. Perfect. Now let's grab a slab and then this slab is gonna connect to this all the way down to there. And then this one is gonna connect to that all the way down to there. Now over here, we got a stupid window that shouldn't be there. Let's get rid of it and let's just put cobble. Just like that. We're done with that piece. Now, watch this. We're going to work on this little uh, lovely section right now. So this is what I want to do. It looks kind of short, right? So I want to make it a little taller. So let's take it up one more. One more on everything. Just one more like this. Let's not make it too tall. Let's just make it one more on everything because I want it to have a little bit of an elevation above the original uh, section right there. Perfect. And now let's take that away. That's away. And we just extended it just by one, keeping the same dimensions that we have from before. Now, let's use this as a base. So this is what I'm going to do. Let's go like this, like this, and like that. Keep this for now. Keep that for now. Then we're going to do it again. So bam, bam, bam. Let's do it again over here. Bam, bam, bam. And then we're going to do it one more time on this side right there. Now, let's do a little baby roof going all the way around just like this and boop. Now, let's do that a bunch of times. So let's do it over here. Let's do it also, guess what, over here. <laughs> and then once we're done with this one, you guessed it right, we're gonna do it over here again. Quad roof peaks on the tippy top and then we're gonna leave it like that right there. Look how cool, I love it so much. Now. Watch this. Let's go inside this thing. Now I'm going to add a little bit of, of different flair to it. Let's put, okay, watch this. First off, let's get rid of this thing. We'll work on something else for this thing. Let's get rid of all that. We'll work on something later. Now for this little part, we can go ahead and bring that in right here. Bring that in one more, bring this in one more, and then bring this in one more like that. Okay, watch this. Now, right here, I'm gonna do this. Let's put upside down stairs, this is the front. So upside down stairs here and here, here and here, yeah. Then I'm gonna put slabs on all of these right over here like so, okay? Let's grab the, uh, uh, the stripped, the stripped spruce log and go up by one and a two, one and a two. One and a two, one and a two. We have this looking like that. Look how pretty. Now, let's grab a stair. I'm gonna put a stair facing this way, this way, this way, and this way. Here we can do a cross beam, that's fine. Just to give it something to, to be perched on right there. See that? That's looking very cool. Now, I'm gonna go ahead and do a little bit of uh, details here. So let's do stairs going all the way around like this. Get that spruce loggy. Let's do here. Let's place that down and let's go up one, two, and a three. Like that. Let's actually do just two. Just, just, just one. Well, technically one from the tippy top. That looks awesome. Then on the top there, I want to get a fence post. Let's get a fence. Uh, this one I'm going to go a little darker. Let's go with a dark oak fence. And then I'm going to put it right here. One, two, three, four. Then let's grab a gate of the dark oak and we're gonna do a little cross right here. We're gonna put one right there and there. Oh, not there, there. <laughs> and we got a little cross action right there. Look how cool, oh, that's perfect. Okay, now, th it's looking good. Now let's do a little bit more work on this. So I wanna do some stuff underneath this. So let's do upside down stairs on all of these right here, okay? Upside down stairs on all of this, just to round it off a little bit there. Now, underneath this, let's get rid of that because we had it like a placeholder. Let's put that log that we had from before and let's plop it in there. Look at this, let's plop it inside, right in here, facing downwards. One more over here. And then we have that done there. Okay, now grab a trap door. Uh, and we're gonna use the spruce trap door and then we're gonna put a little trap door action right there. You can't really see that. You didn't need to really put that, but I just wanted to have that piece of wood there. Uh, <laughs> so it's right there. Let's put that right around and we have that going like this. Look, it's so cool. Look, it's so cool. Now we have this going. Now, another thing we can do now, let's put a window right here. Let's take that out. Let's take these two out. Okay. So we have a double window right here. We got a double window right here. We got a double window right here and we got another double window right here. Let's use the regular old glass. That's fine. Let's use, you know what? No, let's get fancy. What am I even thinking about? Uh, let's get glass. Let's see. Let's do fancy glass. How about we get this black stained glass? Look how nice this one is. Oh, yes. Yes, yes, yes. Let's do that black stained glass all the way over here. And we can even do different colored stained glass, but I kind of like the way that feels. I don't know. Uh, we can also do another one here. We could do two of them there. And we could do another two 
right here. Let's use black stained glass on that. That looks very cool. I love that. Then we can texture this too, bringing in a little bit of the smooth stone just to have a little bit more variation to that. And that's looking lovely. We have a little more over here. And I think if we put a couple more on this side, it's looking nice. I think that looks good. Okay, now this is very plain. It's nice, but it's very plain. Let's do some work. So first off, I wanna do something right here. So what we could do is on this one, let's just take some of these out. Let's just mix these up and make it look cool right there so it's, it varies a little bit. Let's do the same thing on this side. So let's take a couple of those out, put some smooth stone right there, maybe another one of those. That looks great. And I think we have one more to deal with. Let's take a couple of these out. Let's put a smooth, let's put some cobble. Let's put a stone right there. Okay, so these are looking great. I love this uh, here. Okay, we can do some stuff. Let's do some work though, because we need a lot of work on this bottom section. Let's get rid of this one as well. Let's put glass there, change this glass. We're leaving exactly where it was left behind last time. Okay, now next up, we gotta do some stuff. So I'm thinking first thing we wanna do is let's do a cooler doorway. Uh, I'm gonna put an upside down stair right there. Let's go inside real fast. Okay, we have this stuff. Let's take some things away. A lot of space over here, a lot of space. So uh, we'll, we'll work on this right now. So let's go here for now. I wanna do something really cool on this front entrance. So let's actually, uh, I wanna do a little roof like this. I wanna do a little one. So let's grab a cobble wall. Let's replace that glass, take that out. Let's do a cobble wall right here. We're gonna go up by one, two, one, two. Let's do three. Let's do up by three. And then let's grab our slab, which I think is right here. And then we're gonna do a little roof right, oh, right about there. Oh, I think that's a little too high. Let's put a little lower, one lower right there, bam. Okay, that's looking great. Uh, that's okay, I'm not gonna touch that, that's perfect. Now, over here, I wanna do a little something. Let's see, what if we do in this corner right here, let's bring this out. Let's actually do right in this corner, I'm gonna make like a little uh, a little feature, a little feature right here. So let's bring this stone, let's go, actually cobble, let's do cobble, let's do from this corner. One, two, three, four, five, six. Something like this, a little corner piece right there. So let's do that again. So one, two, three, one, one, and there we go. So that goes on this side, that goes on this side. Let's see, hold on, let's come on this end. We're gonna do the same thing on this side. So watch this, so do this. One, two, three. Oh wait, hold on. One, two, Th this, ooh, this was, a, let's see. One, two, three, and then yeah, this is gonna be a little different. How about this, how about this? For this section, for this section, watch this. We're gonna do, how about the, oh wait, how about this? Let's do some mini little towers here. I, I just, I got inspired. Um, right here, let's go from this end. One, two, three, four. And then right here, one, two, three, four. How about we do a little centerpiece right there? Oh, come on, let's do this. Come, come, I'm so excited. So right here, one, two, three, one, two, three, four. And then this is the center. Oh, baby. Okay, watch this, let's do it. Now, let's bring this corner up by here. Let's go, what's this one? So this is two, three, four, five, six, seven. Let's do eight, let's do, let's do seven. Right here, seven. Oh, perfect, perfect, let's do a seven. Now, let's break this piece off. Let's bring in the cobble. Let's lift it all the way up to the seventh on this side, actually for right here, and we're gonna use that piece right there. Let's bring in the cobble in, so one, two, three, all the way up, two, seven. Oh, I'm excited. Let's take away this little ring around the rosy thing here. Bring that in here. Then this is going right there, and then this is gonna go all the way around right here. Right there, take this out, all the way around like that. Oh, baby, look at that. Let's take that up, let's do it over here. Man, I said I wasn't gonna do something like that, whatever. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, this is gonna look cool. Let's take away this little piece out, I'm so excited. So let's bring this down. And then this cobble is gonna go all the way up. We're gonna meet up right over here. I think seven is a little too small. We might go up a little more, but let's just do seven for now. Take this piece off. We're gonna just repeat what we did on that side. Right here, let's bring in the cobble again. And we'll texture it after. Just like this. Bringing it down, perfect. And then you know what? Connect that piece there so you don't have no problems. And that piece is connected, okay, perfect. So we have these little towers. How about this? Let's go up a little more, just so it can have a little more clearance with this roof. Uh, I'm thinking let's take it up by, okay, so that was seven. So eight, nine, maybe a nine. Let's take it up by nine, just so we can have a little more clearance. Let's do a nine right here. 
right there. I think that's gonna be better. So let's do it. Let's do a nine. So let's bring that back up. Let's do it back up here. Yeah, I think nine is the ticket. Let's go. So let's take that little piece out right there. Doesn't matter. All the way up. Let's see. Let's do it here too. And let's finish off right here on this side. Okay, perfect. Let's take that little piece off. I'm gonna texture all this in a second. Okay, so we have that there. Oh, baby. Now, right here on the seventh, let's go up one more. By the tenth, we're gonna cross this with the stone. Right there. Let's cross this with the stone. Right here, okay. Now, watch this. Watch this. We're gonna grab this right here. Let's do something like so. All the way around, like this. On the corners, everywhere, mix, skipping one on each side. On this side as well. Let's go. Oh man, this is gonna look cool. All right, going all the way around. I misclick so many times, it's fine. All the way around like this. And then we're gonna meet up right over there. Okay, now grab trap doors. Trap doors of the spruce. I can't spell, it's fine. Uh, grab trap doors of spruce and we're gonna drop these right on these little pieces we just skipped. Just like that all the way around like so on this one as well right here right there right there perfect so we have those like that check it out oh this is awesome okay now watch this we're gonna do let's get slabs in here let's do slabs right on the ones we put the trap doors in like right there put a slab on top i misclicked there we go slab on top slab on top let's do it on this side too on all the slabs so bam bam Bam, 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 bam. Okay. On top of the ones we just placed, put trapdoors on top of those. All the way around, like so. All the way around. Perfect. Let's do it on this too. Trapdoors on every one of these upside down stairs. Perfect. Now, let's grab slabs. Put them on all the edges. All the edges, like that. We're going to do it here, like that. Let's grab four blocks and we're gonna do, I don't have four blocks. It's fine, let's double slab him. Double slab him, let's do four blocks on all these spaces in between. Like that. Four blocks, I'm just doing double slab keys here. I don't even wanna go in my inventory, I'm so excited to build. Now, <laughs> I'm gonna go all the way around like so. Like that, so we have this look so far, okay. Let's grab a slab, put them right here on the corner. Right here on the middle, I'm sorry, the middle pieces right here. Slab, all the way around. Like so. Let's grab trap doors. And put the trap doors on all these slabs you put right there. So slab uh, right on top of these, well, uh, on top of the four blocks. <laughs> right next to the middle slab. And then we have those. So look at this for now. I love that. So good. Now, let's grab, uh, again, a, a full block. Let's actually do a full block on all of these. Let's do like, like that. There we go. Going all the way around. All the way around. Let's go again here. So, bam, bam. Oh, hold on. I missed clicking. There we go. So, all the way around, like so. Now, once we get to here, okay, let's actually do this. I wanna, let's tweak this a little bit. I think that looks a little better. Now, I said I don't wanna make this roof too big. So, let's do that. And it gives it a nice little uh, up and down a little slope to there we go and then in the middle bam bam let's go bam bam oh baby that is awesome that is really cool there it is just a little roof on the back just so this it's not as tall as this one and it has a nice little slope up to it i love that what do you guys think is that cool what i love it 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 okay now let's do a little bit more details to this so in the back right here i'm gonna put a window let's put a big window right there here i want to put a window to be a little smaller than this one so just a two right there i want to put a single window on top right there so single window on top a double right there okay so we're matching all that let's go over here too double right here small baby one on the top let's get rid of this piece there we go so that matches this that matches that and then you know what we can change it up let's do some upside down and regular stairs on all the windows let's do that here let's do that here here and there that's looking nice let's do one here as well actually i think i wanted it just to there perfect let's do it here and there 
Let's do one here and there. Oh man, what do you guys think so far of, of the, the church upgrade? I'm loving this. It's looking really, really cool. All right, so we have that. Now here, let's do a one, two, take that out and let's do that. So a double window, that's looking nice. Let's go all the way back on this side. Let's do a double window right here. So bum, bum, bum. Let's put this down and that there, perfect. So we have that there, that there. Okay, now we're gonna do something right here. So let's bring in, uh, how about just some podzo and some coarse dirt and let's just mix it up. Coarse dirt, podzo, just like that. Let's do it again on this side. So podzo, coarse dirt, just like that. And then let's grab some slabs of our cobble and let's do something like this. Something like that. Just boom, boom, boom. We can, it, it doesn't have to be exactly the same as that. We can mix it up. So just a little, a little lifts like that. So let's do that. It looks nice. Let's do one over here too. And then we can even drop some pressure plates of our stone and then maybe drop a couple pressure plates where you don't have the slab. So right here, here, and there. Then over here, we can just pretty it up by adding a little bit of bush. You know, I think some oak will look cool. Maybe some of these guys. Let's maybe add some of that. Uh, maybe some tall grass. Uh, let's see. Large fern, tall grass. Maybe some rose bush too. Let's see. So let's go. Bam, bam, bam. Maybe one here. Maybe one there. Let's do a large fern, tall grass, a little bit of the pink and the white, and maybe here I'll do a little rose bush. Oh, look at that, isn't that cool? I love that, let's do it again on this side. It's just random, same stuff, so let's go like this, like that. Let's do a fern, tall grass, let's do a rose bush there, some white, and a little bit of the pink boy there. Oh, wow, there we go. <laughs> That's looking so good. That's looking so good. Let's take a quick little spin and see what we got going. Okay, now let's bring in some of this window again. So I'm just gonna go up with the black. Again, you can use any window you want. You can make a stained glass with different colors and stuff. I'm just gonna go with a plain black, uh, but you can go crazy, have fun with it. Put a bunch of colors, that's cool. I'm just gonna go plain old black though. Something like that is looking awesome. Let's look at this church, come on. I love this so much. Oh man, oh that is so cool. That is so cool. Let's go really quick though inside. Let's check this out. Let's see how we're gonna do this outline here. So for this one, you know what? We can actually take this piece off right here. Oh, let's bum. Uh, uh, I'm just gonna leave that for now. Actually, no, we need to go back out there. Hold on a minute. I think we have full blocks on that. Yeah, let's put, oh, hello. Uh, come with me. Okay, there we go, fixed. Okay, and these up here, I might just change the top ones because I don't want to want to mess with the bottom piece like right there. I think I'm going to leave it like that. Uh, so here we're going to go with that. Leave that piece. Leave that one and then go like that. Perfect. All right. And we're completely done with it. It's looking so cool. The only little thing I wanted to do is, well, first put some shaders on so we can see how this thing looks with some shaders. And... Uh, I wanted to add just a little bit more detail because we have been doing around our area here almost like these little cobble base uh, corners here as extra supports. If you notice, we have some right, right there. These have some, I believe, yeah, right there and stuff like that. So I want to continue that theme. So usually, you know, in most builds, you've probably seen like maybe I'll do something like this. I'll do like maybe something like that. Maybe put a little uh, a, a stair facing down or something to add details around the side. But I like this new style. So let's, let's do some. So for this, I'm just going to go right here in this corner. Let's start one out here. This is totally random just to make it look cool. Uh, maybe a little stair there, a little stair here. Maybe like, let's see, uh, how about... Uh, let's do a full block here. Maybe like a little cobble wall or something like that. Maybe another slab right there. That looks good. Something like this. Uh, this is another wall that we could totally mess with. Uh, let's bring something around like so. Maybe a stair right there. Maybe a slab there. That looks really cool. How about even down here on the bottom? Uh, maybe throw a little wall. That looks great. And maybe just to end it off like a little wrap around. That looks good, like that. Now let's do one here. And it doesn't have to be exact. You don't have to do it just like me. Uh, but if you want, go ahead. But <laughs> if you can do it uh, your own little style. See, something like that, simple. Uh, another, another one right here. And it kind of looks like it's supporting the structure so it doesn't collapse or something. Uh, we don't have the best engineers in this world. Uh, it's a bunch of weird villagers that just go ar, ar, every two seconds. But it's fine. Uh, maybe something like that. Oh, that looks good. Maybe another, maybe a little stair too oh there we go that looks great and then we can even add a little bush uh surrounding it in certain spots like this uh maybe something 
uh, like that. No, that's too high up. Maybe a little corner one, a little corner bush right here is fine. Oh, that's great right there. Uh, and then maybe another one here kind of wrapped around like so. Something like that. I don't know. Just totally random. Make it look cool, natural. There we go. That's awesome. And guess what? Uh, between the last cut and this one, I did some interior so you can see exactly what we have uh, in mind when we're doing a church like this. So this is a little inspiration. Uh, hopefully you guys do like it. You can do anything you want though. Play around with it. Do your own style. But let me show you what you can do as far as interior. Excuse me, villager. I need to get into church. I need to get into church if you don't mind. Excuse me. Thank you. Come on in. He's the preacher. Uh, so coming on in, you're gonna see something really cool. So right here, we have this cool little carpet design. So I decided to put some uh, wool and then some red carpet on top. So you kind of see like it's kind of uh, going up and down, little dips in there, it's pretty cool. And we have uh, the altar right here in front. And then we have the ceiling. Look how cool the ceiling is. Uh, right here, I kind of blocked this off. And up here, we have a spot for uh, the preacher, the deacon, or the pri a priest, whatever it is, um, to sleep. Uh, it's just one little bed right there, a little chest, books, another uh, another chest a brewing stand and we got some hidden lighting right there look how pretty <laughs> and it has windows all over the place so we have that little spot right here a lovely uh, uh, a lovely new addition to 113 is that we can put item frames facing down and we can put books on top so that's a little book right there a little bible and don't worry the shade is a little weird you're not going crazy the wood is moving okay <laughs> so look at this Look at this. So we have a little seating action over here. Uh, not, look, another little book facing down. Some bush action, pots and pans stuff. Not pots and pans of, of, of like flower pots. Not, there's no pans. There's no kitchen in the church yet. Uh, but we have uh, hidden lighting on all of these. So we lit up pretty good. Lights all the way around right here. And I love how this feels. Whoever's sitting here is kind of get blocked off, but it's okay. Uh, this is what happens you know, in uh, stadium seats and seatings and stuff. It's fine. Don't worry about it. They, they, they can just hear the priest. the priest. The priest has a booming voice. Don't worry about it. Uh, he's going to stand right here and do all the preaching right there. The church of sausage is now in session. Uh, but <laughs> there we go. So seats here. And look at this. In the back of the pews, we got... Oh, don't worry about the way we... Uh, thing. Um, we got a little uh, books right here too. We got books on that side, books on this side. And then if you're sitting over here, also books on this side. And I love it. I love this. On the top of the towers, all I did is make it just open. Uh, oh, I wanted to put a trap door there. Uh, but I kind of like the way it looks with that there. Actually, I'm going to leave it open. I'm going to leave it open. Uh, we have it also on this side. So this goes straight up at the, the top. I have one with and one without. There we go. looks better, actually. I like that. Uh, and that's it. That's all there is to it. So this is what you can do as far as interior. So much more space than the original default church. Uh, so we got so much room for stuff here. I love this. I love this so much. So hopefully you guys did enjoy this. This is one little quick spin around here. Oh, man. What do you guys want me to tackle next? Do you want me to keep doing other little houses? You want me to jump to that blacksmith? You want me to do a bunch of cool stuff? I, I might do a library here somewhere. We're going to do some uh, walls, outer gate, gatehouse stuff. It's going to be fun. <laughs> so uh, stay tuned for more upcoming stuff. But let me know in the comment section what you want me to do next. Uh, but look at this. This place is going to be so cool. All right. I'm out of here for now. Thank you, everybody, for watching. Ah, oh, man. I can't wait to build again. I'll see you guys very, very soon on the next episode of Building with Sounds. See you guys later. Goodbye.